My name is Giselle Sang from Kingston, Jamaica, and I attend the Immaculate Conception High School. I plan to study anesthesiology after I pursue biochemistry at the college level. All my life, I've always had a love for the sciences, whether biology, chemistry, or physics, which led me to do a pre-med course this past summer, where I was exposed to patients and surgeries for three weeks at the University Hospital of the West Indies. This inspired me to pursue anesthesiology because I want to dedicate my life to the safety and protection of patients who undergo surgery. Helping patients improve their quality of life has always been a goal of mine and it is something I'm very passionate about. I work very hard at my passions and this is shown in my CSEC and CAPE results. I sat eight CSEC subjects in which I've obtained eight distinctions. And at the CAPE level, I sat four subjects and I also obtained four distinctions. Throughout all of high school, I've been placed on the honor roll. In November, I'll be receiving the principal's award for maintaining an honor roll status since seventh grade. I'm very talented at balancing sports, arts, and academia. And this is exhibited in my tennis career, grades, and ballet. I've been doing ballet since I was four years old, receiving many awards from the Royal Academy of Dance. Ballet allows me to release my stress and I enjoy dancing and expressing myself. Ballet gives me a sense of creative freedom that I can't find in any other art form. My favorite dancer is Misty Copeland because I can feel her personality through her dance. I can feel her emotions, how she expresses herself. It truly inspires me to embody who I am when I dance. Dancing with my ballet teacher, Elizabeth Samuda, has honestly inspired me to become the dancer I am today. Tennis has been invaluable in my overall development, teaching me how to cope under pressure, strategize, execute quickly and flawlessly. Some of my strengths as a tennis player are being able to cope under pressure, being able to strategize, try and figure out how I'm supposed to beat a certain opponent, whether to hit to their forehand, to their backhand, to push them deep, to pull them into the net. It's all a strategy in order to beat the opponent. My strongest attributes on the court are my forehand and slice, and whenever I'm able to use those the most, I'm at an advantage to my opponent. My favorite tennis player is Rafael Nadal because of his fighting spirit. Whenever I play, I try to emulate this attitude. Whenever I have any problems or I have any questions regarding tennis or school, it's very comfortable for me to go to my coaches and talk about it because they always give me the best advice regarding academics and tennis. I always try my best to ensure that all my teammates playing on the court have a positive attitude. I would like to pursue tennis at the collegiate level to see how far I'm able to go while representing my school and giving them my all. I'm Arthur Philpots, the director of tennis at Immaculate High School and I've been teaching her for the past 35 years. I met Giselle when she was in prep school. She actually enrolled in Immaculate six, seven years ago. From the first day she came here, she started on our high school team. And in those days, uh, we were national champions and it was very difficult to get on the team. She played singles and doubles, but more importantly, she was a very good team member. 
When she finished her singles assignment, you know, she'd head to the sideline and she was the loudest cheerleader on the spot. And that's endeared her to the coaching staff and her fellow teammates. The thing I like about Giselle is she knows her priorities. She's been on the honor roll for academics and she balances sports and tennis well, trying to be a student athletes with the emphasis on being a student first. Her strength is her attitude. She never gives up. Her technique is incredible. Very good forehand, very good backhand, good serve. As a human being, that is her strength really. Yes, she's a good tennis player, but good tennis players are a dime a dozen. As I said, what we like about Giselle here is that she's a team member. No matter how much she wins, she always goes and encourages the less talented children. She has a great sense of humor. She's always been very respectful and she's a good model to the younger children. When she comes to practice, she's on time, has on her proper gears and she works hard. She knows how to get along with people. So she will have no problem fitting into any college campus anywhere. And with her spirit, I think she'll be a boon to any college community anyway. I believe I can be an asset to any institution because I'm a scholar athlete. 